<clears throat> hey, what's up, other bronies out there? Okay, I was at Target, and I found a My Little Pony Adventures and Canterlot Jumbo Coloring Book and Activities Book. Now, when I bought this, I couldn't actually go through it because I kind of had to just take it and run and go pay for it. Anyway, when I opened it up and I started looking at the things, I was offended. Not by the childish activities and such they had in here, but honestly, because of just Hasbro's inability to actually market to its true, you know, demographic. Anyway, so the first one that I come up to is how many. Count the items below and place your answer on the line. They have how many sons and then blank sons. Now, the funny thing is they actually thought they had to have an answer key. If you can uh, see that. Answer, nine sons. Okay, so what's really aggravating me is they're putting cliches in here, like the pony maze, getting Twilight Sparkle over to her favorite books. You know, that kind of crappy, you know, stereotypic, you know, shit. Like, like, look, Spar Spike the Dragon, okay, which the, he's never referred to as Spike the Dragon, it's just Spike. He likes Twilight Sparkle's magic. Draw some stars. Okay, now, you need to understand that he does not just like her magic. You know, he's... He's been, um, you know, in, in a lot of things like um, Winter Wrap-Up, like that episode. You know, he, you could say in a very childish way that he liked her magic, but really it was, you know, Spike represented her inner demon to, and her insecurities of not having any other skill otherwise, other than her magic, you know. So it's just, it's just this stupid, like, it's insulting. It's, they're, they're taking the show and bringing it to its lowest denominator, which is just such bullshit. And, you know, like, like stuff like this. I mean, do they even watch the show before they put this crap together? I mean, Pony Maze. Help Princess Celestia fly to the sun and the moon. She, she banished her sister to the moon. Why is she flying there? She never flies to the moon to say hello to her banished sister. Okay? It's, it's bullcrap like that. Who is, who is who? Draw a line from each pony's cutie mark to her correct name. Now, you know, this kind of stuff is pretty cool. I mean, a lot of us bronies have actually taking the time to memorize these different cutie marks. And this is, this is actually using some intelligence to actually see if we can take the cutie mark and match it up with the pony that, you know, that, that it belongs to. You know, and honestly, there's a lot of pages, really cool pages to color, you know, so that, that's what I'm going to do. But just, I, I, maybe you're thinking I'd look too much into the activities in this book, but I just thought it was insulting to me, you know, and, and Hasbro, you're never ever going to make any money off this show unless you actually realize who's watching the show, who's going to buy your stuff. Anyway, go buy it. It's still fun. See you later.